What is up, JL Life? Modo here. Today's video, we're going to be addressing loose e brake. Stay tuned. Ah. I mean, it's, it's really bad. Fixing it's really simple. All we're going to have to be doing is moving this up so we can access the, the tension nut and tighten it a little bit. But to pop this up, we're going to have to get a pry bar, pop that out. There's going to be a second one on the other side. 10 mil socket. Side two. From here, this should be able to pop straight up. Once you go underneath, that guy right there with the, with the cables are going into, you are able just to remove the entire console. If so desired, it's just a lot more work to do because all you really need to get to that is a socket and a couple of extensions. Make it a really quick and easy job. So it is a bit of a tight fit. And if you go under this way, quite literally all you're doing is getting a socket on that nut and just tightening or loosening to adjust to your liking. So it is a 10, you just sneak it on in there and twist it till you get to where it needs to be. So just know that if you go too tight, your parking brake will always be engaged. Don't over tighten. So even though you can check it from the back seat, I suggest getting into the driver's seat to test it before you button everything back up. Uh, just come and give it a couple of pulls and releases. Make sure it's where you want it to be. Remember, you don't want it too tight. That feels good. So now I can pull out my socket. The board that was holding it all up. Drop it down. And put it all back together. So guys, thank you for watching. I hope this video saved you a trip to the dealership. It is a simple, easy, quick, 10 minutes or less job. Thank you for watching. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Stay tuned for the next one. Y'all, keep it easy. Ah.